Hello everyone, this is Carrie with Inkwell Collectibles in Painesville, Ohio. Again, if you guys are ever in the area, please stop in and check us out. We're there Tuesday through Friday, 12 to 7. Saturday, we're there noon to 8. And we are opening our second collector booster box from the Lost Caverns of Ixalan. So here's the front of the box, the back of the box, and we're going to get started with this. I used much better scissors this time. And we all know neon would be fantastic or the Jurassic Park imprint would be amazing again not expecting that out of any of these it's such a rare chance that you would get that but we're gonna see what we get so we're starting with arcane signet in full art foil beautiful card uncommon and we're starting with our first pack and i learned from the last box i need to start at the bottom of these hopefully yep there it is these are way easier to open from the bottom. And starting with our first common right over the edge, buried treasure, shipwreck sentry, miner's guide wing, lodestone needle, that's double sided, the other side is guide stone compass, then contested game ball, earth shaker dread maw, and our full art foil land. Again, first time I saw these, it was a little bit weird. I didn't realize fully that it was a land card at the time. I thought it was just one of the extra add-on cards. Knowing that these are the lands, I think in a deck playing these, that would be really fun. Then we're going into our full, our other Art Kutzel Malamet Exemplar Foil Uncommon. Ooh, upside down backwards. Abuelo's Awakening for our rare story spotlight. That was unexpected. Then Braided Net, Tributary Instructor, Restless Events for our land. Our Jurassic Park card is Forest. Again, those are double sided. Most of them, I prefer the back side, so I do like that one for the forest. And then we have our Mythic Hualti, Poet of Unity, Full Art. There's the back side, is the Saga, Enchantment, Mythic, and then a Fungus Dinosaur. I haven't seen that one yet. That one's fun. And then Regular Dinosaur on the other side. It's another... Backside is our Rex card. I'm going to put that with the others. And onto our second pack. Starting with the bottom, make it a little bit easier. We are starting with Compass Gnome, Deconstruction Hammer, Out of Air, Captivating Cave, Charter Course. Skyclaw Raptor, Bitter Triumph, Full Art Swamp, again, beautiful. Our Showcase Art, Ukenbach, The Great Mistake, Gishath, Sun's Avatar, Mythic, Foil, always a good find. Treasure Map, Rare, Other Side is Treasure Cove. I do have that. I did get the cute to brute deck and that is in there. Different art naturally, but it's a good card to have. Rare full art promise of Aklazots. Sorry. And then Abuelo Ancestral Echo. Full art rare. And for our Rex card on this one, Own Grady Raptor Trainer. And then our full art foil, Trumpeting Carnosaur. And then we have Treasure and Merfolk. 
And then we are on to third pack. We are starting with Staggering Size, Adaptive Gem Guard, Child of the Volcano, Arazka Puzzle Door, Nick and Zill Current Conductor, Tendril of the Mycotiodrant. I was hoping to get a fair bit of the fungus cards in here, so it is pretty exciting to see more of these as we open more packs, obviously. Curator of Sun's Creation, our Full Art Planes. Again, that is one of my favorite cards for these. I like the Pterodactyl in there. Earthshaker Dreadmar, Magmatic Galleon, Vehicle, haven't seen any of those yet for this one. Deep Root Pilgrimage, Sun Frill Imitator, Beautiful Art alternate art, Tishana's Tidebinder, rare. Our Rex card is an island, again, double-sided. I do like both sides of the island cards. And then our full art foil is Dire Flail. Then we have Map, Bat. And now I'm just going from the middle of the other side, just change it up a little bit, starting the bottom, way easier to open these from the bottom than the top. Don't know why they did that. But we're starting with Sh Sunshot Militia, Nurturing Bristleback, Plundering Pirate, Tithing Blade, Bartolome del Presidio, Might of the Ancestors, Jade Sea Stones, and then an island for a full art land. Captain Storm for our showcase. The Belligerent Rare Vehicle. So this one is a fun box to open because I've gotten two vehicles. I did a bundle, a couple of packs from the regular, and another of the collector boosters. Those are the first of the vehicles. I am enjoying this. Now we're starting with Brass's Tunnel Grinder for a Legendary Artifact. Double-sided, the other side is a Legendary Land. Bronze Beak Foragers, Rare Full Art, Rare Land, Restless Ridgeline. Spitting Dilophosaurus for our Rex card. Well, that's fun. If you guys are going back to when you watched the original 1993 movie, when it first came out, this card will bring back a lot of memories. So that is very fun. And then we are going into Preacher of the Schism, Vampire Cleric, and Map Angel. This one is out just a little bit, so we're going to go with it. And we're starting with Thousand Moons Crack Shot, Vito's Inquisitor, Soaring Sandwing, Volatile Wanderglyph, Guardian of the Great Door, Hoverstone Pilgrim, Glimpse the Core, A Mountain for our Full Art Land, Zawa Lava Tongue for the Showcase Foil, Growing Rites of Itlamok, Corpses of the Lost, Hawkball, the Surging Soil for our Mythic Showcase, Aklazot's Deepest Betrayal, another Mythic, this one is Bat God, can't go wrong with those, Command Tower, that is again another double-sided, pick whichever one you like, I like that one, it's cute. And then Restless Vents for our Full Art Foil. And we have Vampire and Skeleton Pirate. And now I'm just going with the very back card from that side.
And we're starting with Attentive Sunscribe, Death Cat Marionette for our Fungus, Primordial Gnar, Insect Horror, Hidden Nursery, Sorceress Spyglass, Diamond Pickaxe, Captain Storm, Cosmium Raider, Planes. These are my favorite of the new lands that they did. I don't know why, but something about it just is very appealing to me. So I'm always happy when I get those. And then we have Kutzel Malamet Exemplar for our showcase foil. Sentinel of the Nameless City, rare. The Everflowing Well, legendary artifact. Showcase foil, Clavelin Leno. First of the Blessed, Mythic. And foil, Vampire Cleric. Breaches, Eager Pillager, Rare, our Swamp for our Rex card. The other side, again, I prefer that one. And then Kutzel's Flanker, Cat Warrior, Rare, Full Art, Gnome, and Gnome Soldier. Now I'm going to go to the very back one from the other side, starting at the bottom just to make in theory, my life easier. We are starting with Screaming Phantom, Seeker of Sunlight, Oak and Siren, Oltec Archaeologist, Forgotten Monument, Confounding Riddle, Clay Fired Bricks, and Forest. So we don't get a whole lot of forest in this. That's always good. I've gotten quite a few islands. So getting anything else is always nice. And then we have Isquint, Firstborn of Gishamp. Pugnacious Hammer Skull for a rare foil. Jade Light Spelunker, rare full art. Tetsun Gnome Champion, rare foil full art. Bringer of the Last Gift, Rare Vampire Demon. And here we go for our Rex card. We have Henry Wu, Engine Geneticist. That's always fun. And our Spotlight card is Lord Wingrace. Full Art Foil. And then our token is Gnome and Gollum. And we are way more than halfway through, so I'm just going with the last. And we are starting with Goblin Tomb Raider, Envoy of Okanek, Ahu, In the Presence of Ages, Poison Dart Frog, one of my all-time favorite cards. He's just adorable. You can't look at him and not be happy. But getting him, yeah, it makes me happy. And then Belligerent Yearling, Self Reflection, Soul Coil Viper, a Swamp, Rampaging Ceratops. I have gotten him before. Palani's Hatcher for our rare Sunken Citadel Land. Mist Dancer, Creature Merfolk, Polani's Hatcher, Rare Dinosaur, our Plains. This one, the other side, makes me sad, so I prefer the front side of that one. That's going there. And then we have Skull, Skull Spore Nexus, Mythic, Alternate Art, Foil. So that's fantastic. Great card to get with that. Treasure, Dinosaur, and pulling out of the middle from the other side. Four packs left after this one. We are starting with Hualti's Final Strike, Unlucky Drop, Itali's Favor, Hidden Volcano, Bat Colony, Spyglass Siren, Stinging Cave Crawler, an island. Again, I've had a fair bit of those. Thrashing Bronodon. Warden of the Inner Sky, rare. 
Sanguine Evangelist, Battle Cry, enters the battlefield or dies, create a 1 1 black bat creature token with flying. The Indomitable, Hulking Raptor, Mountain. I again prefer this side. So we're keeping that one up. And Rare Corpses of the Lost. Then we have Treasure and Fungus. I do love the art on the fungus cards. You can't go wrong with that. It's a skull, an animal skull, and fungus on it. Mushrooms. We are starting with another chance. Cogwork Wrestler, Dynamaton, Daring Discovery, Waterlogged Hulk, other side is Watertight Gondola, Malamet Warscribe, Rampaging Ceratops, and the regular art, the first time I've seen that one, a Forest Full Art Foil, Nick and Zill, Current Conductor, Throne of the Grim Captain, followed by just the Grim Captain for a rare foil Squirming Emergence, Contest of Claws, Molten Collapse, Alternate Art, Rare, Forest again, that's the side I prefer, our Rex cards, we're getting back into duplicates of these, hoping to see more, well, we have two more packs, so hoping to see two different cards on those. And then we have Breaches, Eager Pilliger for our rare, and Dinosaur Egg and Dinosaur for our tokens. Second to last pack. Fingers crossed, something amazing. But we are starting with a Braid, Cartographer's Companion, Tectonic Hazard, Hidden Courtyard, Gold Fury Strider, Hermetic Nautilus, Malamet Battleglyph, Plains, one of my favorite of these lands, Breaches Brazen Plunderer for Special Guest. I did get both of those cards in the last box I opened. It'd be nice to get something different, but we'll see what they have. Kellen, Daring Traveler, Rare, Adventurer Sorcery. Kite Sail Larcenist, Illustrious Wanderglyph, Akol Pakol, First Among Equals Human Advisor, Grim Gigantosaurus for our Rex card in foil. So beautiful. Finally, getting something a little bit different. Then, Warden of the Inner Sky for our rare and no Vampire Demon. Last pack. Fingers crossed that it is spectacular. Again, so long as the Rex card is a little bit different, I'll be happy. But we'll see what we get. Atlakan Landmark, Mephitic Draught, Armored King Collar, Thousand Moons Infantry, Visage of Dread, Kutzil, Malamet Exemplar, Spelunking, Mountain. So again, keeping it a little bit different. That's nice. It's not all islands this time. Capricotti, Sunborn for the Showcase Foil. Restless Anchorage, Rare Land. Tarian Sun Soul Cleaver, Rare Full Art. Curious Altasaur. Bonehard Drakasaur. Cresting Mazasaurus. Not full, uh, not double sided on that particular card. Tishana's Tide Binder for alternate art foil. Beautiful card. And then we have Copy and Spirit. If there was something you guys were hoping that you saw or that you saw and you wish you saw more of, please feel free to leave me a comment. Let me know what you were thinking. Again, if you like what you saw, don't forget to hit like and subscribe. These are the rares, or sorry, not the rares, our Rex cards. These are our special guest cards. Lord Windgrace, Breaches, 
These are our rares. So quite a few of those. This is a fair bit. Pretty happy with that. Fair bit of commons and uncommons, which again is to be expected. Also, some of these were the alternate art or showcase art mixed in. Can't go wrong with those. The lands, we had the mountain, the plains, forest, island. We all know that one's my favorite. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Have a good day.